And like you have the no limit off-road wheels, the Venom Bullet wheels, they got them in different colors, like green, purple, yellow, orange, blue. Um, they got different kind of wheels and stuff like that. So definitely get with uh, no limit off-road for wheels for uh, UTV side-by-sides, Gorilla Axle for the Silverback tires, um, and these are the 30 by 11 by 14 uh, Silverback tires. Um, you see the little Gorilla on them. And um, I said, got a lot of people that looks at the project. Sonic Electronics for uh, car audio supplies. Uh, Next Concepts and Designs, which was a big thing. It's where the, uh, the he calls us the Jay Leno chin. Uh, Next Concepts and Designs, the eyes light up on it. And he's got the little Jay Leno chin uh, turn signals. He casts them, hand makes everything. Um, um, he does dragons. Uh, like I said, his name is Next Concepts and Designs. His name is Chris Six Killer. Uh, right there is one of his cards. Um, does all kinds of custom stuff, mostly for, they were made for Harley Davidson's, but we just uh, partner with him and just show off on uh, anything you want to use it for. So then you got the original chin skull headlight back here. The eyes light up on it too, and the uh, turn signals. So definitely get with Chris Six Killer at Nets Concept Designs. Look at his website and see what all he's got. Um, Night Chill Studios for the eyeballs that light up inside the seats and everything. So, uh, Night Chill Studios for Halloween lights and other Halloween accessories. Um, Piedmont Plastics in Knoxville, Tennessee for all kinds of plexiglass and acrylic. Uh, Fates Customs for the, uh, the controllers. They're airbrushed. They got a name on the back, FatesCustoms.com. He's really good. He can, he can do console, the whole console, like a PlayStation 4, Xbox, or Nintendo. He can take it apart and airbrush it. And he always does controllers, puts clear buttons back in them. And you can put, he can have your thing, he can do one of those where it's called the Skull Crusher and lights up. He can do whatever you want with that. Um, he's really good. It's somebody that knows how to do electronics and airbrush. And it's really rare to find somebody that can do both of those things perfectly. So definitely get with uh, Ian at Fates Customs for your airbrush on consoles and controller console gaming systems. Uh, current manufacturing for tow packages. Uh, power stream for voltage reducers. Uh, VIP air for uh, fender flare extenders for the Articat side by sides. Uh, flip custom switches for the uh, rocker switches that light up. You can see the, they light up and everything, and they uh, custom match whatever you want, like skull headlight, skull tail light. And you can um, get with them, um, flip custom switches for all their custom rocker switches, running 16 of the rocker switches in the project. Uh, Gorilla whips for all the accent lights down here that you see right through there. And the uh, light whips back here through uh, Gorilla whips. Just can't touch. We got Vision X, so it's a rock clock kit underneath the project. And then we got a uh, Ricochet Off Road, which is a UTV only company that makes skid plate system for these side by sides. If you're riding up the mountains, get with Ricochet Off Road for skid plate system for Articat, Polaris, or Can Am. Combs Custom Manufacturing in Kentucky for the, uh, the windshield. It's actually got a fold down piece. We don't use it, it's like a fold down windshield, which is really nice. Uh, full roof, it's an aluminum racing roof, and it really helped me out to build this headliner. Um, mount it, they make it for Articat, and then the uh, back glass for an Articat uh, 1000 Wildcat. Just no touching, please. And, um, and the um, uh, Mayor Manufacturing for the splash guards. You can see the splash guard underneath there. The Mayor Manufacturing that makes splash guards for uh, the UTV industry. That way you don't get any uh, mud or anything up in your radiator. And again, we're back at the um, the Cabin Fever Car Show in Knoxville, Tennessee at the uh, Knoxville Expo Center. They call it the Grand uh, Expo Center now. And um, 
Um, it's January the 14th to the 15th. This is day one. Um, and it's a very it's a pretty nice day out. And um, like I said, it's called Cabin Fever in Knoxville, Tennessee. And um, and just um, keep on enjoying the show.